The spring and summer of 1854 were a dismal time in London, England. Throughout the city, outbreaks of cholera were causing thousands of deaths. But the physicians knew why. Bad air. It was called the miasma theory, and it held that disease was caused by London's noxious, polluted air. But one physician thought differently. Dr. John Snow. Not that John Snow, Game of Thrones fans. This John Snow. A physician who was skeptical of the miasma theory. He thought that the cause of cholera was something in the water. 127 people died on Broad Street in only three days. Snow plotted the locations of the deaths on a map of Soho, including X's where each water pump in the city was located. He showed that the deaths centered around the Broad Street pump. Although no one could actually see the bacteria through Jon Snow's microscope, the authorities in Westminster removed the Broad Street pump handle and the outbreak subsided. It was later discovered that the Broad Street well had been contaminated by leakage from a nearby sewage pit. A baby who had contracted cholera from some other source had his diapers washed into that sewage pit. The fecal bacteria from the sewage leached into the drinking water, contaminating the well and poisoning anyone who drank the water. There was even an exception that proved the rule. Adjacent to the Broad Street pump was a monastery, and yet none of the monks in that monastery ever contracted cholera. The reason? They didn't drink the water. They drank beer. When the 1854 cholera outbreak subsided, the handle was replaced on the Broad Street pump, and life on Broad Street pretty much went back to normal. But what about Jon Snow? And what about that crazy germ theory? Well, it was abandoned. The idea that Victorian Londoners were drinking water laced with poo was rather distasteful. In Soho, London today, just across the street from a replica of the old Broad Street pump, and down the block from the childhood home of William Blake, you will find a pub, the John Snow. So if you find that pub, drop in and raise a pint to the memory of Dr. John Snow, who taught us that excellent statistical graphing and judicious beer drinking could save your life. <laughs>